a chord of length 5 cm subtends an angle of 60 degrees at the center of a circle. 60 degrees at the center of a circle. Center of a circle, 60 degrees, we know the radius straight away. I love this question because I know this number. I like this number. Chord of length 5 cm makes an angle of 60 at the center. Think about this. 60. Any chord and angle at the center, these two are radii. These two are equal. Now, this is 60 degrees. That means these two angles are equal. They are also 60. Or our circle has a radius of 5. Now, angle of 120 at the center. A chord, the length in centimeters of a chord that subtends an angle of 120 at the center. This is very simple. This is trigonometry 101. This is 120. This is 5. So this angle is 120. This should be 60. This should be 60. This, this is 60. We know how to find this. How do you find that? This is 30. This will be. Let's let's name this. I'm going. If you've not got the answer, pause. Sin 60 is BC by OB. Root 3 by 2 equals BC by 5 or BC equals phi root 3 by 2. BC is phi root 3 by 2. AC is phi root 3 by 2. AB is phi root 3 by 2 plus phi root 3 by 2 which is phi root 3. And it really helps to know that the moment you have a 60 degree angle in the center, you're talking about an equilateral triangle. So the radius is 5. In a 120, 30, 30 triangle, the sides are in the ratio 1 is to 1 is to root 3. It helps if you know that. Uh, but it's not required. You can just plonk in this, do some trigonometry and then get to the answer.